In this question here, I managed to draw a simple star network topology containing four desktop computers. What a topology is, is the shape of the network and the star topology should actually look like a star. So with four desktop computers, I should be able to draw a diagram that actually looks like a star. So what I need to do is start with drawing the hub in the middle of the rectangle there. What I've done is I've used a pencil and a ruler for the drawing and I've labelled it hub. Now what I need to do is draw the lines that connect to the desktop computers. So I'm going to come out like that and you should see it starts to resemble a star shape. Okay, what I'd recommend you do if you question, get a question like this is you draw it so it looks like a star as much as possible. So you see, the examiner can see that you've actually recognised that this is a star network. Now what I need to do is connect the desktop PCs to each of these each of these lines. So there's my first one. Now I need another one. There's the second one in place. Now I need the third. There's the third one in place. Now I need to put the fourth one in. And there's the fourth one in place there. Slightly wonky in the monitor there, but you get the idea. What I want to do now is label these all four of them desktop desktop, okay, desktop. PC and the reason for that is I don't think you can spell it out too much what you've done to the examiner just to make that clear okay so I've got one two three four there I've got four desktop p computers I put PC maybe computer there okay just to be clear about that that sh that that should be really clear to the examiner desktop desktop computer, desktop PC, desktop PC, okay, one, two, three, four, so draw a simple diagram to show a star network topology containing four desktop computers, so as long as I've got the hub there and I've got the connections, I've not been asked to put a printer on there or anything else or show a connection to a server, I've just got my star network and you can see it looks like a star shape, okay, and I've got my four desktop computers connected to it. Now this next question asks me to draw uh, a bus topology containing four desktop computers. For AQA, there are only two topologies in the new spec. That is star and bus. There used to be ring, but that's been removed. We've got star and bus topology now. So what I need to do is draw the backbone of the bus, bus network topology. Now that is the backbone of the bus topology and what I need to do now is connect all the four desktop computers I've been asked to connect to it. That's the first one so one down three more to go. Now there's the second notice that I've sort of staggered or staggered it there so it's not directly underneath I think it just looks better I just need to do another couple now. There's the third and just need one more to finish it off. Now there's the fourth one, and that, that's the four that I've been asked to do. Um, notice that I've used pencil for the drawing, I used a ruler, I've taken, taken my time to do that. I've got these terminators there, I wasn't asked to do that, but I put them on there anyway, these terminators, and I've staggered it just so it looks a bit better. And I've also labelled it very, very clearly, and, and, and that with the 1.1 gains me four marks in total. So a couple of tips then for, for answering this question. Um, I used a pencil and ruler for the diagrams and I labelled it very, very clearly as well. Um, and that should show the examiner that I, I can answer that question and uh, I've done it as neatly as I can. And I think it just looks good and I should be able to get full marks for that question. The bus topology looks like this. It's just literally a backbone with computers connected to it like that, okay? There may not be a hub, there may not be a server. It's just a very, very simple network. And that's one of its advantages. It's so simple and in relatively inexpensive to create. And that is your bus network. 